Hero of Comics here. Before getting back to, his chrono, to, chrono, to more Chrono Trigger, I just wanted to do some other things, including this silly anti Trump flyer I found in this ba men's bathroom. Mm -hmm. Basically, men's bathroom downtown. Right. Now, I only glanced at this thing, mm -hmm, you know, before doing this. I wanted to be surprised along with you. Right. I've seen some very silly stuff in here, so, you know, already by glancing at it. So I want to just go with you, go on it with you. Uh, let's see how this. Let's see if we can get this to work. <clears throat> All right. Uh, so the anti-drop player. Well, this thing is crazy. Let's go. No. <clears throat> a call to action. No. In the name of humanity, we refuse to accept a fascist America. Drive out the Trump Pence regime. The Trump Pence regime is a fascist regime, not insult or exaggeration. This is what it is. For the future of humanity and the planet, we, the people, must drive this regime out. Oh. Okay. Oh, so far, so good. Oh. Well, ish, sort of. Donald Trump and Mike Pence have assembled a vicious cabal that has put forth positions and begun initiatives which demonstrate that they fully intend to shred political and social norms with catastrophic consequences. Because Trump has his finger on the nuclear trigger, the Trump Pence regime is more dangerous to the world than even Hitler. No, that's impossible. I'm uh, sorry, but how many millions, how many people, thousands of people has Trump killed by putting him in internment camps? <laughs> okay, no, none. No, I'm sorry. Sorry, no. no. <laughs> this is where you disagree right here. I'm sorry. That's that's what I saw. I don't like no, no, no. <clears throat> Basically, this is the fear of someone having that amount of power, <clears throat> you know, <clears throat> coming coming through. Let's continue. Let's continue, please. Let's continue. Fascism has direction and momentum. This this dissent is a piece by piece is piece by piece criminal criminalized. The truth is, bludgeoned group after group is de demonized and targeted along a trajectory that leads to real horrors. All of this has already begun under the Trump regime. <laughs> Some things are definitely more hated on than others, <laughs> but then of course when you know, President Obama was in office, you know it was the other way around. <laughs> you know, so it's, eh, it's kind of interesting how that works. Go. History has shown that fascism must be stopped before it becomes too late. Well, that's true. Millions of people outraged by this regime took to the streets, delivering a stinging rebuke to Trump the day after the inauguration. Yes, and the Electoral College. Mm, don't forget that. Protests and and resistance continues against the many attacks on the people by the Trump Pence administration. This must grow broader, deeper, and more determined. This resistance is a, is righteous and necessary. True. Mm -hmm. Well, against tyranny, yes. Mm -hmm. But it is not sufficient. We must recognize that the character of fascism is that it can absorb separate acts of resistance while continually throwing the opposition off balance by rapidly moving its agenda forward. The Trump Pence regime will repeatedly launch new highly repressive measures, eventually claiming, clamping down on all resistance and remaking the law if they are not driven from power. Mm -hmm. In the first weeks of the Trump Pence regime, they have begun subverting the separation of powers, the separation of church and state. Uh, they call for a new nuclear arms race. Yeah, okay. Demon demonize the press. Okay, yeah, that that that's gonna happen. That's gonna happen. <laughs> yeah, because the press hates you know, the, you know Trump. Okay, uh, dismissing the very concept of truth, submit substituting their own fabricated alternative facts. Uh, yes, they have. <laughs> Uh, at least sometimes yes. <laughs> it can already be said of Trump hints that first that first they came for the Muslims then for the, then the Mexicans <laughs> then all refugees then women and then black and Latino people LGBT and Q persons the environment anyone who doesn't conform or submit to their vision and plan plan Yes, these are, these are kind of small words. I gotta work on that. Plan. Four nation co 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 cohered or uh, around white supremacy and a political form of Christian fundamentalism. Uh, well, that does seem like it, but uh, the, the white supremacy. The, the problem with that is that he's white. <laughs> okay, so when he says we want to make we want to make a great. A, I'm gonna, we're, gonna, I'm gonna, we're gonna work to make great America make great again. Like a white man who's rich and in, who's rich <laughs> is saying this. So he, yeah, he means white supremacy. That's what you know, I, I don't know about that one. Mm -mm. 
Christian fundamentalist, we are fundamentalist. Where are they? Where are they? Where are Christian fundamental political form of Christian fundamentalism, in a way, but uh, there are some issues with that that are definitely against Trump. <laughs> you know, because this guy has to work on uh, the legality of well of everything he does. <laughs> if he's trying to do Christian fundamentalism, it has to be totally one hundred percent legal, <laughs> or it won't work. <laughs> you know, be totally one hundred percent legal has to abide by the rules, the laws of God. <clears throat> has to be, you know, squeaky clean, you know, or it'll be like, oh, this is, you know, no, this is legal, this is wrong, this is sin. Mm, so, yeah, there you go. <laughs> that should rightly be called Christian fascism. Christian fascism! <laughs> well, <coughs> the wrong kind of Christianity is Christian fascism. Mm -hmm, let's go. Mm. Fascism is not just a gross combination of horrific rea reactionary policies. It is a qualitative change of how society is governed. Fascist informants and relies on xenophobic nationalism. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Racism, yes. Misogyny, yes. And the aggressive re institutional oppressive traditional values. Um, can, depending on what those traditional values are. No. In Trump's <coughs> election campaign, he encouraged and fed on the threat and used the violence to build a movement and come to power. Huh? Mm. Maybe? Mm. How would you, what would you say that? Mm. You mean like, like, against America's enemies? <laughs> you know? Against terrorism? Terrorists? Yeah, it's a little weird that one. Mm. I don't know. Maybe you could say, yeah, he did hate on certain enemies of America, but... No, we'll see. Well, I don't know if that exactly would count as actual true stuff there. <laughs> uh, in Trump's election campaign, he encouraged and fed on the fact power. Is in his inauguration address, he pledged allegiance only. Continue on back. Have the back to this movement. What is crucial to understand is that once in power, fascism essentially eliminates traditional democratic rights. Well, yeah, because that, that's how you stay in power. <clears throat> but, yeah, that remains to be seen, seeing as he's just president. <clears throat> Ugh, go. Even as the Trump-Pence regime is moving fast, they have not yet fully consolidated the regime. Oh, okay. <clears throat> or as yet, been able to implement their full program. How does that work? But, this is their objective, and it is very possible. It may only take a single serious crisis. Oh no, you're not you're not gonna go there, are you? <laughs> you're not gonna go the George Bush route. <laughs> Nine Eleven with the George Bush route. Oh boy, they they might they they're going there. They're going there. Okay, let's 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 see let's see let's see them go there. A single serious crisis, international or domestic. <laughs> Nine Eleven, for this regime to drop the hammer, we do not have much time. <laughs> you know. Well, someone who's thinking f in fear, <laughs> thinking something could happen. You know? So yeah, that's how it works. Don't normalize. Don't accommodate. Don't consolidate. Don't collaborate. There is a method to Trump's madness that echoes Hitler. How? Mm -hmm. Come on. Fascism advances in stages throughout rage, shock, and intimidation, followed by brief periods of normalization where people accommodate to the new situation the regime has imposed. After the election, Obama said of Trump, we are now all rooting for his success. No. <laughs> if Trump succeeds, humanity loses. <laughs> I don't know. Well, I don't know. <laughs> That's the issue. Other than, of course, in those ways that, you know, environmental issues, educational issues, things like that, that people are always talking about, saying that, you know, he, you know he's not really fond of those, funding those, so it's causing issues. Uh, so they're, they're basically like, oh, right there, he wants to destroy the environment, destroy education. You know, they go to the, the extreme of that. You know, same here, I'm thinking. Yes, continue. Bernie Sanders has said that he will work with Trump on jobs where and or where they agree. No. If you work with fascists, you normalize the road to horror. <laughs> I don't know if he's a fascist, though. It's not, yeah. <laughs> he's definitely. It's possibility, but it's like. We have not seen that kind of stuff, especially nothing like Hitler at all. Thank you. Because, of course, he's in power, but that's what a lot of people are. So, so yeah, no, come on. Not going to work. Not going to work. You can't just, yeah, he's going, they're, they're going to keep doing it, but it's 
It's not it's not a good uh, allegory. <clears throat> it's not a good allegory for him. So let's go. Um this is not just a pendulum swing Democrat to Republican, but a regime that's moving to establish a fascist order under the signboard of America first. <clears throat> okay, okay, come on. Acting as if the election in 2018 or 2020 is the way to deal with this regime is folly. Uh, well, I, I agree. I do not agree with it because, well, I agree that that's one way to deal with it because, yeah, we just vote him out or and his friends. Anybody who worked, who voted, who helped him get voted in, we, we definitely work on that because, you know, they won't have an electoral college to protect them. So, yeah, continue, continue. Let's go. Uh, but still, I'm definitely looking forward to those times because then I can actually vote. So, there you go. That's how it goes. It's folly. Betraying a lack of understanding of just how fast years and finally this regime will change the rules. Good. Try to change the rules, but eh, we'll see. Let's see. Amend its rule. Destroy lives and crush spirits. Yeah, we'll have to find out. You're not trying to wait things out. Mm. Well, you, you, you can't just. Mm -mm. You can't just. Mm -mm. I agree with that. You have to be active. You have to be like, okay, yeah. Mm -mm. Where do we vote? Where do we talk? How can we? We gotta, we gotta speak up because, yeah, someone's trying to stifle our voices. Electoral college. And so we have to. It's best to speak up, to speak out, and be more vocal so that then they, they will. They try to, you know, stifle our voices one way. We can come out, come out another way. And things, you know, like that. You know. Mm -mm. We can't vote. You know, we can't, our votes for president aren't, aren't aren't counted. Then we vote for someone. Uh, Congress, <laughs> you know, Senate, uh, mayor, you know, all kinds of other things. You know, kind of, you know, and just be like, yeah, yeah, you know, handle things other ways. That will definitely help. You know, gotta stay active. Gotta stay active, knowledgeable about politics and whatnot. Because you know, you gotta make sure to find opportunities to show what who what we really think about this stuff. No, I agree with that. Come on. Also lived through Nazi Germany and sat on the sidelines, looking on as Hitler de demonized, criminalized, and eventually rounded up one group after another, became shameful collaborators with monstrous crimes. Yes, but so this is not the same thing. <clears throat> He's not. A, you know, king. <laughs> He's president, and it's it's not the same. It's not, no, no, he can't. They don't have that. He doesn't have that kind of power. Come on, let's go. All of this is what renders the Trump pinch regime illegitimate and a grave threat to people all over the world. Therefore, we resolve. Oh, no. yeah. In ways, it is legitimate because we voted against it. Well, I didn't vote against it because I didn't want to vote for Democrats. But still, I knew he would lose. That's what happened. But still, and he did. So there you go. Oh no 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 no! Get get out of here. Okay. And he did. So what else go? Therefore, we resolve our resolve our single unifying mission to be must be to drive out the Trump Pence regime. Okay, kind of. Mm -hmm. We didn't any stop things like that from happening again. Where you know someone who was voted was out with lost the election still gets to be get you know win get to be the you know, president oh, that's that's just weird that's just weird we must manifest the power of no everywhere well, yes i agree with that on science billboards walls social not well our own walls social media and in the news yes no in the name of humanity refuses to have a fascist america must resound oh. three every outrage committed by this regime must be met with greater and greater resistance <laughs> Yes, as long as it's not illegal, anything like that. Continue. Four, we must organize, working with all of our creativity and determination towards the time when millions of people can be moved to fill the streets of cities and towns day after day and night after night, declaring that they're in this whole regime illegitimate, demanding and not stopping until the Trump Pence regime is driven from power. Okay, I agree with a lot of this stuff when it comes to speaking up and speaking out about what we want, what we don't want, as people, as the people of this country, <clears throat> you know, as long as it's done legally, <clears throat> so we don't have to worry about, you know, so we don't get in trouble, you know, we're not worried, you know, legally as in, you know, not harming, hurting anyone, <clears throat> you know, basically, not hurting anyone, that's the issue, <clears throat> so like that, we gotta make sure we're not trying to do that, because that's dangerous, <clears throat> you know, there was, a, there was a protest that caused problems like that, that caused problems like that before, and it just was like, you know, <clears throat> Cause, you know, it was one of those things where it's like, okay, these people are protesting. Someone got killed by police. Okay, I understand that. That's that's terrible. And we need to stop. We need to be careful about that stuff. You know, definitely speak out against that happening when it's an innocent person. 
but there is no need to block traffic, <laughs> you know, and, and cause all all kinds of civil unrest, you know, that way, <laughs> you know, that causes you know people to do other criminal activities, <laughs> you know. So uh, that's what I'm saying. Okay, continue. If this happens, then the whole political landscape would be dramatically transformed. Every faction within the established power structure would be forced to respond, and all this could lead to a situation in which this fascist regime is driven from office. You know, yeah, because it's like, yeah, the money. Mm -hmm. you know, the money will dry up, mm -hmm. you know, because the people who are getting that money are like you know, in danger of being voted out. So it's like, okay, crap, they're going to vote me out, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah, you, know, you gotta do something. I gotta, I gotta be, you know, actually do stuff. <laughs> you know, I like that. No, I like that idea. Fight against it. Let it not be said that we did not move heaven and earth to drive out this regime. This must be a moment in history when millions stand together with conviction and courage, overcoming fear. Yes, definitely overcoming fear and uncertainty to resist and to say no, not just for ourselves, but for the in the name of humanity. Drive out the Trump pinch regime. Then review fascism dot org. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm. Okay. So this thing had some great stuff in it. Mm. This thing here has some pretty cool stuff in it. No. Mm. You know. But definitely trying to say that it's worse. That he's worse than Hitler is is not not going to work because he, he's he's not he's not he's mm -mm. he's just president. He's not he's not king. He's not Fuhrer. Mm -hmm. he's, he's not someone who can put people in into jail mm, into um, prison. You know, into a, inter internment camps or whatever, whenever he feels like it. You know, he there are all kinds of rules and regulations that make it so he cannot just be an autocrat or whatever. <clears throat> he can't. You know, it's not the same at all when it comes to that. With that said, this is an annoying thing because he was not supposed to win, but they wanted him to. Anyway. Someone wanted him to anyway, so he did. So that's tyranny. That is bullcrap. We should fight against it. You know, definitely be, keep our cool and keep you know, talk. You know, keep our cool. You know, basically not not lash out with hatred and anger, with hatred and violence. But definitely continue to get the word out about whatever goes on. Continue to be you know wise about you know knowledgeable about what's going on in our politics, things like that. You know. Definitely show a response to this stuff, stuff to stuff like that. Oh, this and stuff like it that is definitely shows that it you know, was not a good idea for them to do that. You know, stuff like that. So yeah, this this yeah, uh, this pamphlet, or this flyer review here is basically I give it this say this thing is very passionate flyer, a very passionate flyer about something that is very divisive and has a lot of tyranny tyranny involved in it <clears throat> you know not necessarily with Trump himself because you know he lost the election <clears throat> so but uh, still um, no 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 comparing yeah comparing it to one of the worst people in history not gonna work uh, so yeah that was a huge problem there so yeah I'd say if as long as they you know you have you know Get the word out. Stay informed. Stay knowledgeable. Don't compare him to someone who has was is a different type of. You know, he's a different kind has, kind of ruler than this guy. You know, the office this guy holds is different than that of uh, Hitler. So I'm sorry. No, yeah, yeah, that's the main issue there. It's it's not the same. So you know, yeah, overcome that fear. Overcome that fear. So yes, overcome that stuff. Cause yeah. Oh. This is not as bad as that. <clears throat> it's not as bad as that. It's not good, but it's not as bad as that. See you guys next time. Check me out on YouTube and DeviantArt.